Star Wars fans, Kathleen Kennedy might be removed from Lucasfilm. Now, this is just a rumor, and it might not happen until the summer of 2023, but still, Kathleen Kennedy is out of here! What's up guys, it's Mike, a guy who loves Star Wars here. Today we're talking about Kathleen Kennedy finally getting the big boot out of here. Now yes, this is just a rumor, it is a rumor, it's just a rumor. But it could most likely, probably most likely will definitely happen. Kathleen Kennedy has been president of Lucasfilm for 10 years. George Lucas sold Star Wars to Disney 10 years ago and Kathleen took over. Now what has she done since then? The sequel trilogy, wow, fantastic. Didn't split the entire fan base on that one, Kathleen. Rogue One, which made them a ton of money, but still had a ton of production problems with Tony Kilroy having to come in kind of at the last minute and save the entire project. The Solo movie, which literally took Star Wars out of the movies because it did so bad, stopped us from getting a Boba Fett movie and an Obi-Wan Kenobi movie, and instead turning those into shows. Also, she's brought Star Wars to Disney Plus to stay forever and completely stopped making Star Wars movies. In Kathleen's defense, she brought John and Dave together, John Favreau and Dave Filoni together, to make The Mandalorian. But to go against Kathleen again, John Favreau had the idea for The Mandalorian, went to Dave and Kathleen and said, listen to this idea, and they said, that's a fantastic idea, and Kathleen said, you two should work together. So pretty much in the last 10 years, Kathleen has greenlit projects that have completely divided the Star Wars fan base and has done the job that anybody else in the world could do by just putting John and Dave together and letting them do whatever they want because they are the brains of the operation. We won't even get into the Halcyon Cruiser where it's $7,000 for a two-night stay, or the complete lack of merchandise for shows like the Obi-Wan Kenobi show, The Book of Boba Fett, even The Mandalorian, with a character like Grogu, all you see is shirts with Grogu on them, and you go to a store like Target or any other store that sells Star Wars merchandise, and there is nothing on the shelves. And that's not because they're selling out of everything, that's because there is no Star Wars merchandise. Now, why do people think that Kathleen Kennedy is receiving the boot in the summer of 2023, except for all those reasons I just gave you? It's because Indiana Jones 5 is being released June 30th of 2023. And Kathleen has been around since the beginning of the Indiana Jones franchise in the very first movie and has been a producer on all the movies up until which is supposed to be the last one in Indiana Jones 5. And nobody at Disney will ever say anything bad about Kathleen Kennedy, so they are going to let her off the hook and she's probably going to resign or say, I'm going to step down from my role after the Indiana Jones 5 movie comes out. Now again, this is all just rumors from sources that are very reliable sources, but they even say that it is just a rumor. Nothing has been confirmed. Kathleen, as of right now, is not going anywhere. But there is this gigantic overarching cloud rumor that says she's a goner in the summer of 2023. And a lot of it does kind of have to do with this JPEG being fired news and Bob Iger coming back. I know Bob Iger was the CEO for 15 years before and was CEO for the first eight-ish years of Kathleen being the president of Star Wars. And he didn't fire her over those eight years. But what is the difference now is that Disney is plummeting and so is Star Wars with it. So they have to make changes and they have to make them quickly. And there's no better change than new leadership. Now, who could be the new leadership? We talked about John Favreau and Dave Filoni earlier in this video, but I don't think John Favreau wants to have that role. He's a guy who makes movies. He made the original Iron Man movie. He did not become the president of Marvel. He doesn't want that job. He doesn't want to be an overarcher guy. He wants to be in the director's chair, doing the stuff on set, creating the content. And the same can be said about Dave Filoni. He created the Clone Wars with George Lucas. He created Rebels. He created now the Ahsoka Show, the Mandalorian, the Bad Batch. And if you're a Star Wars fan, you want him creating. You want him hands-on on every project that is ever created by Star Wars. So I don't think either of those guys are a good option. Now you're left with the question of who is a good option. Kevin Feige would be a great option, but he seems to have his hands pretty pretty full over there with Marvel, but you never know. Maybe Kathleen sticks around for a couple more years where Kevin can get done what he wants to get done at Marvel, all the way up until probably Secret Wars, and then he steps down from Marvel and comes over to Star Wars to get something new going. 
or maybe it's just somebody else. But who? Tell me in the comments who you think should take over as president for Lucasfilm. Because honestly, I got nobody. I don't see anybody who would be a great president of Lucasfilm right now. And unless you tell me in the comments, I will never know. But tell me in the comments, do you think this rumor is true? Do you think Kathleen Kennedy's getting the boot next summer? Or do you think she's just going to stick around till the end of time and just bury Star Wars into the ground? Smash like if you like this video, hit subscribe, and hit that bell so you get notified every time I post a video and my pretty face will show up in the recommended feed of yours. Whatever happens, we'll still be getting Star Wars content, and hopefully it's really good Star Wars content. And by that, I also mean good Star Wars movies. Because Kathleen also seems to be the reason that there are no Star Wars movies for the last three years, and what looks like the next three years. But tell me in the comments, don't forget to hit that subscribe, and may the Force be with you, always.